Lucy Bird, and welcome back to Cattails. And today we're gonna be continuing on with our wonderful cat field adventure. Of course, I think in the last episode we actually ended up getting uh, accepted into the Mystic Colony. Let me get this. I don't know if I'll need it or not, but my inventory's full, so I probably don't need it. Uh, I'll, I'll get a golden seal. I'm sure I'm gonna need it. But uh, yeah. We ended up getting accepted in the Mystic Colony, which is a very, very good thing because that means that we can go back there and do that one gem mission. So that's like super duper exciting. I'm going to save the game and then go to sleep. Sleep it up, yum. Good cat, good cat. Okay, I'm excited for this. Um, We also have to not burp into the microphone, big goal. But also we have to go ahead to, oh darn it. We have to go and see Missy, wherever she may be. If she's out right now, and if we're waiting, then we might as well add, we can sell stuff to Ember, but I don't have to worry about that for right now. Hi, Missy, would you like a gold of Mary? Oh, hey, Zeep, are you here to like ask me on a date and something? I will give you Mary gold. Well, at least you have good taste. Awesome. Probably we wanna wait for her heart to become red. But uh, for now, uh, do you want my frog? Don't answer that, it's yours now. All right, well, the frog's okay. Nothing crazy there. I might even just give Sarge a frog. How goes the day? How does the stalk, or how goes the stalk, Zebra? Catch anything good lately? Uh, well, I uh, caught a very nice uh, relationship. Here we go, uh, here's the toad. Yeah, not my thing. Yikes, okay, that didn't work. Well, that's fine, I can give a Valerian to Doc. Good to see you, Zebra, here to chat for a bit. I've got time for you all. Oh, Aw, oh, you didn't have to do that. Thanks a bunch, Zebra. So nice. Let's talk. I hope you don't mind, but if you head out into the forest to waste and see any flowers or berries growing, could you bring them back for me? I could always use the help. Those herbs serve a good purpose, you know. Okay, cool. With that being said, we're heading this way. I wanna head back to the Mystic Colony as soon as we can and do that area under there. Cause I'm not really too sure what it is, but hopefully if we do something similar to uh, what we did before, which is you know like the other trial where we had to fight a bunch of bats. I'm hoping we won't have to fight as many bats this time, but there's only one way to find out and that's just to get over there. Oh my, oh my, I'm getting carried away by the current. Oh, that was scary. Uh, I probably should have put some stuff away here, but I think I'll be fine. How's my hunger? I could get away with eating like a mouse. Okay. But yeah, let me quickly, what is the button for it? I wanted to check out my our experience right here. I have 128. I think we need to upgrade our swimming. A lot of people confirmed um, that yes, you can swim to a magical island at some point on, down in the sea. There you go. Very cool, but um, to do that, we are definitely gonna have to upgrade our swimming, so I'm gonna try to be doing that for the next little bit. Oh, that was a turtle. I thought there was somebody chasing me there for a moment, it was weird. I mean, I guess the turtle is chasing me, but in a different kind of contextual chasing. But yeah, I don't think I have too many things I can submit. Oh, it is the third of summer. Yeah, there's Eli again, or Ellie, not Eli. All right, let's make our way down here. Either way, we're a couple minutes into today's episode. I might as well talk about the cat of the day. And the cat of the day will be Tom. Now, Tom is our largest cat by like height and size and everything. He's just a big boy. Uh, he honestly looks very similar to the Musketeers. There's no relation though because uh, we actually saved Tom in Florida. Or at least I, Michaela did. I didn't know. Tom at that time, but Michaela saved Tom and then she moved to you know where we live now and then, yeah. But uh, yeah, Tom is one of the cats she originally had, I think like her third or fourth one. Uh, Tom is such a sweetheart. I love him so much. He has some weird habits. If you try to pet him, he'll try to bite you, but not like, not like oh, stop petting me, I'm angry at you, but more like that, hey, uh, I just, I just wanna bite you because you're cool. Like he has like a love nip. Greetings, kitten, where are you off to? I always see you darting back and forth through the town, Zebra. What are you up to this time? Um, a lot of things. <laughs> but um, I wanna see, oh, red butterfly. Not exactly what I need, but, you know, I don't see it too much. So Savannah, can I buy it from her? But either way, Tom's a sweetheart. I love him so much. He just likes to nap. He is one of the few cats that can get along with just about anyone. He's never mean to anybody. He's never fighting with anyone. He just wants to chill out, have some lunch and take a nap. And that just, like, very few cats have that in our house. It's like usually one cat doesn't like the other one. So we have to have this whole ecosystem where some cats live in this area and some cats live in that area. I thought, hi Savannah, hey there, how are things going? Oh, hello there. I don't think we've seen each other before. My name is Savannah and I like to collect different rare and unique items at my shop. Feel free to poke around whenever you'd like. Please, please have like some of those birds. Buy items. 
Uh, take a look at these imported goods. Oh, really? Not too much. I mean, I guess, oh, you have some stuff here. You have some different colors, which is cool, and an inventory expansion. I wonder if that inventory expansion is different from the other one. Also, an odd mask with a long beak for your cat to wear, just like Beaky. Cool, we got spikes, a nightcast, there's a lot of stuff. Calicomania, Bee Tabby, Gold Tabby, Cinnamon White, I think that is, as is abbreviated. Interesting. Not exactly what I was looking for, but glad to know I have a couple more options. The only thing I saw that was interesting there was the green firefly, but I don't think that's something we actually need for our completion. Uh, hi, Lisa. Hello, Zebra, how are you? Ask about Weeping Room Key. I've already unlocked the entrance to the Weeping Room for you. Be careful as you explore it. All right, I will. Thank you. So Weeping Root should be a couple spaces over. If we go like this, we can see Weeping Root. So we gotta go one down and one left. All right, that's fine with me. Move it, move it. Okay, so Steam didn't just totally bombard me with uh, notifications or something. Oh, well, that hasn't been happening the entire video. I don't think it has been. Beneath the Weeping Root. I have a new computer, so like I guess I forgot to change the Steam settings. Okay, I'm a little nervous here. Also, I didn't notice that our call in friends button is on a cooldown right now. Because when we last call on friends, I guess sometime last episode, it's still just, you know, oh wow. Yeah, yeah, it is just taking care of another group of bats, so hopefully we can hold on for 88 seconds. I mean, technically we could. Come on, get you. Where are you running to? Yeah, you better run, you jerk. There you go. Uh, yep, there's gonna spawn in more, but that's okay. Luckily, when I pull this kind of stuff up, we're fine. Which is good, because I'm gonna have to last a little while here, but I should be okay. It's just the problem is that the, the, you know, the cat reinforcements we call in aren't the toughest. Boom, let's do that. That got rid of one of them. Okay, sorry, there was a loud noise. I think it was a car passing by. Oh boy. Uh, I'm a little nervous here. I got a lot of damage taken there unnecessarily. Try that. We have a lot of health regeneration stuff, but it takes a while to properly, well, regenerate. Okay, and then, Oh, 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 you didn't get me there. You didn't get me there. Oh, come on. Come on. That was awkward. That was really awkward. Get you. Get you. Well, this guy does four damage. Why does he do more? He does more than the other bats. Oh, is that it? Or is there still a bat? Oh, yep. here he is. Got him. And then got him. There we go. Now I'm starting to get a little bit. It's a little bit easier to manage when it's just one of them. Well, more. Oh, no. I want to need more than that then. We still have two more waves of this. is gonna take me a little while. Hey, hold on. Oh, I got him. Oh my, that is a lot of bats. Okay, we have a bit of an issue on our hands. Also, I don't know why the menu button is flickering. You know what it is? It's my mouse. There you go. Hold on. Oh gosh, come on, this is bad. This is really bad. Oh, oh, that hurt. Oh, can I just wait five seconds? Five seconds, five seconds, five seconds, and then boom. Help me out, help me out fam, help me out, help me out. Please don't hurt me. Oh, they're hurting me still. Gosh darn it, guys, guys, guys. What are you doing? Well, you changed your, your, you can't change your enemies right in the middle of it. Oh, come on, this is bad. Why is this so difficult? Um, I wanna try for one last heal, but it's not gonna be enough, I don't think. Cause we still have one more after this. Yeah, this is not gonna work. No, this might be the last one actually. Oh, but winning it? That's a whole different story. We might just have to do it the very slow, very boring way, where we just chip away at it for a little while. Is time going by while we're in here, by the way? I don't think so. Oh, come on, come on. It's just weird because you can't do this with the joystick. Like, it, like the D-pad has its own thing. I mean, I don't know if the D-pad actually has any buttons applied to it, but like I can't move with the D-pad, and I feel like that'd be easier than the joystick right now. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take us forever. Oh, come on, dude, really? No. Oh, hold on. Oh man, we're gonna be here for a while. I might just have to like try this myself and then cut back if we end up doing it, just pecking away at him. All right, so I only have one more bat to take out, I think. So I could technically just wait here for 180 seconds. That would just be the boringest thing ever though. Oh gosh, I just gotta be careful because he does five damage. Okay, you know what? I'm waiting 173 seconds then. Oh no, not, none of that, please. If there's more, I gotta skedaddle, but for now, I don't have any healing left, so I just gotta wait it out. I'm just gonna be doing push-ups. 86, 85, 84, 83, 82, 81, three, two, one. Okay, I gotta be careful, because I only have five health and he hits for five. 
Ooh, that was close. We did it though. We did it with five health remaining. You found a jewel. You should take this to the arcane pillar in the temple ruins. You bet I will. Warp it to the sacred temple. Holy cow, that was as close as it gets. Man, oh man. Okay, I'm here now. I've made it. How you doing, Ellie? Give me that rose. I'm going through here. Oh, I got my turtle on my back. <laughs> Great, we finally have the red jewel. Let's put it in the arcane pillar and see what happens. Oh my. This is really cool. I'm nervous though, like I mean, I guess nothing will really change. We've already gotten one. Incredible, the arcane pillar's powers have been restored. There's just three pillars to go, we can do it. So yeah, we can go up to this and nothing happens. Uh, hi Zebra, any new discoveries? If you find the right items, you should try placing them next to the pillars. Okay, well that means we have, what, three out of the f six pillars, so we're halfway done. That's awesome, so now at this point, all we need is two more birds that I rarely ever seen. I mean, I've only seen one of them once and then we messed it up, that was the end of the last episode. Two yellow butterflies I have not run into at all this season, but we have plenty of time. And then a bunch of fish. The fish are the hardest part and that's definitely what we're gonna get done today. I mean, it's pretty uh, early in the day, but I'm very afraid of running into enemies. Oh, let's try to get this fish. I don't think it's one of the ones we're looking for, but at this point, I really don't know if they're supposed to be in the river or not. Ready, whoop, yeah, what was that? That was one of them, Simon. We should go back and do that now then before I die and really be embarrassed. I'm almost positive that was one of them. So maybe they could just be anywhere. They're not just specifically ocean fish or non-ocean fish, even though that would be the river fish one, right? I don't know. Oh. Oh, hi, Zebra, thanks for coming by. What's this? I'm really glad that you've been so willing to help me. I know it's not your problem. It means a lot to me. The Forest Guardian means a lot to me as well. Ever since they disappeared, they, thought it was it, like a singular. Uh, it disappe they disappeared years ago. I've just felt lost. Maybe I can explain a little better. When I was a kitten, I was a lot like you. I lived in a human house and had a human family. Everything was great, until one day, it wasn't. My human family drove me out into the wilderness and left me, just like you. That night, I curled up under a tree and cried until I fell asleep. Aw, it wasn't fair. I didn't even know how to survive in the wilderness. That's when the guardian found me, still under that tree, alone, shivering, and hungry. So, in a way, he's our forest guardian. The forest guardian took me in, taught me how to live out here, gave me a home. He is our forest guardian, how cute is that? The guardian was always fair, but still kind. I miss him terribly. When I saw you out there in the forest, I knew I had to act. It was the right thing to do after all that was done for me. But enough reminiscing of the, in the past, we have a job to do. Let's bring that forest guardian back, Zebra. May, maybe we can restore the balance. Maybe we can. That was a nice little, yes, yeah, salmon. So maybe this is the lake one. If I hold this so I can put, no wait. If I hold this so I can give it to you and now we're one salmon down because this was all ocean fish. Oh, it doesn't even tell you anymore. But that one, pretty sure that one had ocean fish could have scallops and sea bass and stuff. I mean, the other one might have had sea bass as well, honestly, I wasn't looking. But hey, there's still one fish down, only a couple more to go. I'm so happy about it, I sang. And I could keep singing if I wanted to, but I don't know if I do. Okay, we are at 5% health. I need to get my booty back there. Oh, oh, but hold on. If a fish is here, I need to take the opportunity. Ready, set. Oh, that was an awkward angle. Oh, well, better luck next time, right? Also, what is my experience at? We got 20-ish experience from that then. Not really too much for how much damage we took taking care of all those bats. I do need to go mining soon. We haven't done that in a while. Just a matter of, it seems to be very time consuming. I mean, there's a lot to do left in this game. I'm not really sure how far we'll get into, I guess just until, you know, as we're having fun. I know I'm not the best at this game. I'm glad that you guys have patience about that. Um, I need to start befriending more people. The zebra hug is a day. Well, you look awful, did you get into a fight? Yes, I did. Actually, let's just pay Doc to heal us. That might be the easier thing to do than trying to sleep it all off. I need healing, well, let's see about that. I can treat you fully for 30 muse if you'd like, or I can just give you a small dose for eight muse. Uh, treat me fully. Thank you so much, Doc. There you are, all better, stay out of trouble now. I will, I will, I promise. I don't, I don't promise. Uh, let me get you, nope, let me get you. I don't really need you too much, but we're gonna go to the shop, ember shop, visit shop, sell items. 
Uh, I don't have too much to sell, and I can't select it with the controller for some reason, but uh, there you go. There you go. Nothing crazy, but at least I can get it out of the way. Sell items. Cool, that'll make back some of the stuff I just lost, so that's good. And if I talk to you again, what do you have to buy? Nothing new, right? Not looking like it. Yeah. I mean, I could buy the shiny trinket, I just don't know if that's exactly a good idea. I mean, maybe it is. Whoa, what in the world are you? Where are you going? Oh, no, 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 I'm gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss whatever that was, because it, whoa. I'm gonna miss out on that, but that's a glowy butterfly right there. I've never seen that before. Maybe just another tier unlocks. Once we, we get all these pillars down, I'm almost positive that butterfly skedaddled, which would have been a huge bummer because I've never seen that before. Man, that was an unlucky spawn because it just sort of spawned in a bad spot for me. Weird, it was like a mixture between a butterfly and a f Weird, very weird. Hi, Lyris, I don't see you around too much. Good day to you, my rose. First they crawl, then they run over the white blue ground. Speeding on, they reach their goal on distant shores that take their toll. I wrote that poem while peering across a lake on the northwest. You should visit it sometime and sit on its shores while you think. Okay, sure. What would you like? Would you like a Valerian? Give Valerian. Ah, thank you, Lyris. We truly like these. Okay, you do. I've given Missy her thing for today. You are not quite what I'm looking for, but I'll take you. Mayor! Mayor, wait! Greetings, Day Sharp out there. Uh, do you travel a lot? If so, you've surely seen the rumbling stones to the south. They were laid by the humans before the, our kindred came to this forest. Okay, cool. Hold on, hold on. Let me give you something. I'm gonna give you a lavender. You know, and it strengthens our colony. You should be all about that. Thanks, that was very thoughtful of you. Okay, well, it was something. I mean, that sounds very political of him. Like, you know, it's not really that he enjoys it as much as he's just appreciative. So probably those rocks south of here that humans placed, I'm not really sure which ones. There's a lot of rocks. Well, I'm just gonna be looking for fish, to be honest with you. I don't really care too much more about anything else. Hmm, I mean, it would be nice if I could catch. <gasps> butterfly, yellow butterfly, I need that, I need that, I need that. Who? did I get it? Where is it? Here, got it. Nice, I really needed that. That's perfect, so in 40 seconds I can teleport back. I don't do exactly just that. But first, you know what, I might as well get some free. Whoop. No. Yeah, get back here, you little booty butt. I'm glad we got the yellow butterfly, that's awesome. We need the yellow one, right? I'm almost positive. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was the yellow one. Got it. But for now, we're gonna keep making our way south. Hopefully we can find more fish. But it's crazy how much progress we've been making with the game. I mean, whoa, we're 19 episodes in. It's about time we eventually make some, whoa, whoa, is this a battle area? You bet it is. Um. Okay, how is our team doing? Not so great, not so hot, I gotta be honest. Don't attack me, attack my teammates. I know it's awful to say, but it really does help. <laughs> okay, so I got that done. Thank you, Lavender. Uh, hi. I wish I could take a break, but I'm supposed to patrol the entire region before I go home. I'm sorry. Oh well, <laughs> not my problem, not my job. I got my own jobs to do. Like collect a whole bunch of things for pillars. That I don't have a beginning to, con you know, understand, like I have no clue why the pillars are here. But hey, not my problem also, it's not my job to care about, it's my job just to make sure everything happens the way it's supposed to. I probably should have went into here once we had the insta destroy, but at the same time we handled it. That was fantastic guys, good job. All right, so we're back in, we're we're uh, bouncing back from, you know, uh, the healing pretty quickly. These are some interesting trees around here, by the way. I like them. You don't really see them like this anywhere else. I want that crow, though. This crow is mine, it's taking a swim. Beautiful, beautiful crow. He's not mine! No! Goodbye. It was nice seeing you. Okay, so hopefully uh, we can catch at least a couple fish that I need. I can already teleport back, which I'll definitely use. Oh, two for one deal. Oh, that's baloney. Try to get you. There we go, that's a sea bass. That's definitely not anything I need. Sea bass, like, I'm pretty sure was on the other pillar. Oh, hey, easy conch, that'll be a good 15 muse or something around there. Maybe I shouldn't be. Maybe I should be focused on the river stuff. I know that there should be by now. No, actually, it's not here in it still. Okay, at some point or another, there'll be a, a, a new catnip there, but for right now, it's not. 
The only benefit with the fish is that they aren't gonna be able to go too far. That was a trout. I think I need a trout, so that's good. Uh, Looking for other fish. I don't really see any, so I'll keep going north. Actually, you know what? We'll teleport back now. Not back, but to the temple. That'll surely be helpful. Okay, I like those. Like, it makes like a intense, like, bassy noise, and then it goes, whoop, you're here. Okay, so I have a couple things I can deposit, right? One trout, so if I go here, and that was the one that was in the, no, I did the wrong thing. This was the one, did I just eat it? I thought, oh no, I put it, oh, I got the wrong one. I was about to figure out, I was like, what? There you go. <laughs> so yeah, I think that we're just getting river fish and I'm getting confused. We need two of these bad boys though, holy cow. Hard enough to find one. All right, well, we did it. See you, Coco. We are making great progress. I'm really worried that a second room is gonna open up though. It's gonna be like, hey, yeah, it was just phase one. I got four more to do. I'm pretty sure Stardew Valley pulled that stuff, you know? That was like, oh, I finally got it done. Five hours of just earning one item. And I was like, oh yeah, that's just gonna open up another room full of things that you gotta get that's gonna take equally as long time. Which is like, it's not awful if that's what you're looking for, but I wanna make progress inevitably, right? Okay, well, I might wanna hit the hay soon because it's good to get the five free experience, you know? And I'm also low on hunger, but I do have things to eat. I'm not really too worried about that. Okay. Ooh. What, really? I feel like he jumped not as far there. Like typically he jumps farther than that. So that was weird. I don't know, it sometimes just works that way. I never really get it. I need to have a golden seal. Also, there should be new battles today. There are. Oh, oh, darn it, got a little too excited. Wish I could find that other super butterfly again. It looked beautiful. Well, I got you anyways. You thought you could get away. Not the case, my friend. All right, so let's run back to our home. I want to see what other upgrades we have. I don't know if time pauses while we're in our house, but I could only hope, right? That's a balloon, but I'll grab it. I can give it to uh, Missy if I need to. But probably easier to give those to her than the marigolds. But hey, let's talk to this guy really quick. Mulby, uh, summon Mulby. Hey, Mulbster, how you doing? Salutations, did you need something? Looking to upgrade your den, maybe? Yes, please, visit shop. Um. So yeah, we have a nursery room, a garden room, or a spare room left. I really don't know why we need a spare room. I think the nursery room is what we want. Uh, as a nursery room to the back of your den, you'll need to upgrade this if you want to have kittens, it takes three days to complete. Adds a garden room to the right side of your den, so you can start growing a few herbs from home, it takes three days to complete. I don't know if we should be getting this stuff for an inventory expansion, let me know. What do you guys think I should be spending my Muse on right now? I know a lot of people want me to get cosmetics, but at the same time, if there's real game things to be do doing, I'd really rather focus on that. So let me know, do you think I should be doing, you know, the nursery expansion now, or if I should be doing inventory expansion? Like, there's a lot to do. Anyways. Hey, Mayor, how you be? Greetings, stay sharp out there. The forest colony is strong and it has been that way for a long time. We have lived beneath the trees for many generations. We have a great respect for the woods that we call home. I feel sharing in our proud tradition. I try. I'm gonna give you another Valerian. Oh, that was lavender. Never mind. <laughs> okay, Missy, I have a butterfly for you. I definitely have given her a tiger, tiger butterfly in the past. Give the Azure butterfly. Well, at least you have good taste. Um. Remember Zebra, if we're going to be dating, you need to be fashion forward and always look your best. That way we'll both be the most glamorous, blah, blah, blah. blah. Oh, I can't speak, sorry, I'm congested. All right, give this, no. Uh, no, no, oh, yeah, that's not what I meant to do. Did I pick it up? I think I picked it up. Anyways, give this to you. Wow, thanks for thinking of me, Zebra, I love these. Then let's talk to you. Uh, I hope you don't mind, but if you head out into the forest a ways and see any flowers, yep, okay, I already read that. That was yesterday's message, weird. We're on the fourth stone. I'm just gonna go look for fish again. I think that's my best bet for anything. I mean, maybe we'll run into that battle on the bottom right as well, and that might be worth my while, just for an extra couple coins. Um, how was our experience? 67 already. If I could get another swimming, that'd be pretty good. I might try to, ooh, catch you and then swim across this river, see how, how well I fare. That'll be a good way to find out. Wow, look at that jump. I usually do not jump that far, that was insane. Right, can I get this crow? Can I jump as far with the crow? 
Now the crow's gonna go out of the screen. Oh my gosh! That is insane! I love it! He just jumped super far. Okay. I don't know if I wanna go under this bridge or not. I don't trust it. Ooh, I do not trust it. Well, let's try to get you. Oh my gosh, that isn't crazy. Well, there's definitely another trout. I don't know if we needed another salmon, but if, if we do, we, we got the salmon. Something was moving on my screen there, but I think it was just like a mouse or something. I'm not really too worried about it. Um, No, uh, what's it called yet? No catnip. Hmm. Where's that battle? It's actually one to the right and then one more up. And maybe I'll just, oh, hey, they're everywhere. Here, boom, that was good. That was an easy one. Oh my, this is a lot of cats. Like a lot of cats. Oh gosh, and they, oh gosh, help me, Prince. Hold on, Prince. Prince, no. Jeez, you guys have no chill. They won that one, no problem. Okay, well, I'm gonna go north now. See you guys, you win. Yay. Okay, well, I still, you know what I never, did I need to offer more things to the, I guess I don't need to, I got 50% for the uh, Mystic Colony. Maybe I should start working on getting into the other colony now. I'm sure if there's one gem for one colony, there'll be another one for another colony, right? That would make sense. Well, we might as well get to it then. Go north, make sure not to give them any fish though. I have to save that for uh, the pillar. I'm not catching up to you very well now, am I? You are just moving down that current real quick. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, couldn't quite get the magical jump for that one. Don't know what's possessing me to jump that far, but I ain't gonna complain about it. Okay, well, going to the next colony might have to be something we save for next episode. But in the meantime, I can at the least go to the tower, not the tower, but the, you know, the town square and donate more to the pillars, you know? So let me get over there. If I can just skedaddle on this way, skedaddle on this way, yeah. I don't know why I'm singing so much today. Just trying to fill the air, I guess. All right, Coco doesn't have a monologue for me, that's fine. It'd be nice if we could find some easy fish around here. So one salmon and one catfish. So actually the trout that I've gotten I can keep, which is great, I'll sell it. Um, so one salmon, and I need to find a catfish. I've never found a catfish be before, but once I do, I'm done with it. And we need to find one more tiger butterfly, and then we need to find those darn birds. Don't really know where to find them, how to find them, all that kind of stuff. But as we make our way back to town, I would like to thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Cat Tales. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment zebra fishing so I know you've watched at the end that you are a zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the zebra herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.